As high-tech COVID vaccines have rolled out in wealthy nations, the developing world has largely been left behind, unable to afford them and unable to produce them. We've done an appalling job of actually sharing vaccines and ensuring that the world is vaccinated. It's an urgent problem. Epidemiologists have warned the next virus variant could emerge in a highly unvaccinated population, the way Delta and Omicron did. We are only going to get in front of this uh, pandemic and have vaccines widely available when you have vaccines that are being uh, produced locally, distributed locally, and are made at scale. Researchers in Texas have found a way to do just that, developing a vaccine called Corbivax. It's based on traditional vaccine technology that can easily and cheaply be made almost anywhere. And we think it's a game changer. Many manufacturers can make it. They have all the ecosystems in place. Dr. Maria Elena Botazzi and Dr. Peter Hotez started their vaccine research after the 2003 SARS outbreak. When COVID-19 arrived, they realized what they had. And then, of course, when we saw the sequence, we said, oh, my God, this is like 80 percent similar to the SARS sequence. What's more, they're making the vaccine formula free to anyone who wants it. No patents, no licenses, simply a gift to the world. When you're in a crisis, you really want to do things that are morally imperative and that, you know, that you address the urgency. In clinical trials, the two-dose Corbivax has proven 80 percent effective against the Delta variant. Studies into Omicron and boosters are ongoing. In India, one manufacturer is already planning to produce 1.2 billion doses per year. Look, if you want to develop vaccines that are for the public good, you need to share your knowledge. In developing their vaccine, the researchers hope they've created a global model for tackling future diseases, one driven by the need to save as many lives everywhere as quickly as possible. Jackson Prosco, Global News, Washington.